Hey guys, I never truly got the chance to do my one month update on the little wiki hair, but um, I have the hair in for now for a month and about a week. I had it for a month um, back in um, June, July area because I got it for my prom hair and I had it for a month, kept it till like about July-ish. Well, it was like May, July, June, June-ish, June-ish. That's how long I kept it for. And um, I liked it at first. It was doing well. It was doing well. I had sealed it with some um, fray, not fray check, but the other one, fray still, something like that. Some fray type of thing. And I had sealed it. And it did well for like maybe the first couple of weeks and then it started shedding like mad crazy I think after I washed it for like maybe the second time or third time or whatever it started acting all crazy and stuff like that because um, I guess the glue started coming apart so the hair wasn't acting as good as it originally was and it started shedding like I had a picture I think I did a video on it where I had um taking the hair out and um, detangled it and stuff like that and it was acting so funny so on one of the bundles I tried the um, bleach and um, the bleach and ammonia thing to get the hair to start acting right again and I did that so um, it's been okay so the last time I had it in was maybe June or something like that so July August October November December January so I guess um, maybe about six months later six seven months later I put it back in again and um, uh, right now I have it in of course and I've had it for about a week or so and um, it's still shedding like crazy I did reapply the fray but I only applied it to one side because it kind of ran out so um yeah the next time I if I were to put it in again I would put it on again in like um, I'll um, definitely do it on both sides and I'll get the fray check or fray whatever and I'll try that and seal it in again and hopefully that will work to subside the shedding but it still sheds which is very annoying it sheds a lot it doesn't shed like a dog just <laughs> just like all over the place and you can see hair standing everywhere it's not that bad but it's bad enough to the point where if you brush your hair a lot of hairs will come out so it's it's really annoying so, and I did color this hair, as you can see here, I did color it, and the hair does did have split ends, but I trimmed it, and you can see that in my trim and layer video on how I trimmed the hair, and I, um, what's it called, so it's shorter, of course, I think it's probably about a 16 inch and 18 inch or so, um, let me pull it down, so maybe it reaches maybe about boob length <laughs> or so, um, in the back it reaches maybe maybe like below bra strap length a little bit below it so it's probably around the 16 or 18 inch and I, I didn't measure it again neither because I know it was shorter because it would break and um, split ends would come up which was really annoying and it's probably because I colored it with bleach and then I colored it again and I colored it again with developer and then I colored it again with the actual hair dye by dark and lovely which I have a video on that as well so if you want to go see that watch that I don't know so that's how I kind of came up with these results so it's like a brown shade and the black hair is a closure that I made and you can see that video as well and I'll post that down below as well and I ventilated this um closure by her so I, ha I have a video on that as well on how I ventilate hair and um, yeah, this is the second closure I've ever made. Um, the first closure I made was pretty good, but I do like this one better. I definitely improved a lot from the first time I made my closure. So yeah, well, um, what else do I have to say about the hair? Um, the hair is still pretty full, as you can see here. And I only used two and a half bundles instead of the three bundles that I used the last time I did my hair. And it still, it still looks pretty full. Like you can see it has body to it and it's moving and stuff like that. So yeah, um, that's about it <laughs> for the hair. Um, hmm. Still pretty, still looks pretty good. It's just the shedding. It's evil. It's annoying. Um, yeah, it's just shedding's the main thing that's so annoying. This hair would be so good because it holds a curl, and um, as you can see, it holds a curl. Like this is like flat iron curls that was held in flexi rods overnight as you can see uh, this is all day honey and I even just brushed it out just right now so the curls are so much more tighter 
and I put a little bit of hairspray on it and like it came into a cute little Marilyn Monroe-esque type of style so it was like a bomb.com this morning <laughs> so um yeah those are all the specs on the hair the only real issue with it is the shedding um it didn't have no real annoying beards or anything of that nature um the hair still looks pretty full as you can see here i mean you can see with your own eyes um that's that's it uh yeah yeah and the closure is a different color it's a black color so it doesn't really um it's not the same color as the actual hair because the hair is like a tech browns and golds and blondes in it so that's what you see the main thing that's the main most annoying thing is that shedding if this shedding would dissipate his hair it would be all right with me but that's the only thing. So would I recommend Lick Lewicky? Uh, not really. Because <laughs> that, that's the only main thing. If they fix that shed-in issue, this hair would be the bomb.com. But if if not, because this hair can hold a curl for days. Like, for real. That's the, that's the only issue. So I'll see you guys there. Let me actually go now because I've been talking forever. Bye-bye.